Real quick, just letting you know about my second channel, Cosmic Extra, where I'll post the full unedited videos of everything that goes up here, plus other random speedrun related stuff. Besides that, I just wanted to say thanks so much for watching this marathon. It took a lot of preparation and work to do it and to get it out to you. So please click the like button and leave a comment so as many people can see it as possible. Enjoy my friends. Welcome to the Mainline Mario Marathon. We will be playing 18 Mainline Mario games in under 24 hours, hopefully. The games in the marathon, this is them chronologically. That is what they are in order of release date, but that is not the order that I will be playing them in. It would be really lame to play like eight hours of Galaxy in a row, so I split those up and I gave a nice healthy mix of 2D and 3D. So, the order we will be playing them in is as follows. SMB1, Super Mario Bros. 2J, also known as The Lost Levels, but the original Japanese FDS version. Then we will play Mario 64. Then we will play Super Mario Bros. 2 USA. Super Mario Bros. 3. Super Mario World. Super Mario Land. Super Mario Land 2. Super Mario Galaxy. Super Mario Sunshine. New Super Mario Bros. New uh, Super Mario 3D Land. New Super Mario Bros. 2. Super Mario Galaxy 2. New Super Mario Bros. Wii, Mario 3D World. Then we'll play New Super Mario Bros. U, in this case Deluxe. They are virtually identical. And finally, we will wrap it all up with my very own digital copy of Super Mario Odyssey. <laughs> okay, here goes. Go! It has begun. At any point, if the audio is bad, imbalanced, whatever, let me know. Of all the games, this is the one I'm best at and most well known for. Already missing a split, let's go. <clears throat> We're gonna grab a mushroom, not for safety. I mean, it is safer, but it's also faster. Once we get the fire flower, we'll save time. By killing Bowser at the end of each Bowser level, you don't have to watch him fall in the lava if you kill him with fire. <clears throat> okay. Here comes the fire flower grab. Very good. Okay, we got the fire. Hopefully we never lose it. Uh, this game is warpless because I felt like it. I thought it would be really lame to play only five minutes of the game that started it all. Especially when I'm good at it. And... I can afford to spend 15 extra minutes to show off the entire game, you know? Um, there's a wide range of how good I am at all the games. That's a hard pattern. <clears throat> like this game, I am quite top tier at. There's some other games I am top tier at. Mario 3D Land. That's another hard pattern, holy cow, that was like the hardest one I've ever seen. Mario, New Super Mario Bros. U is definitely the game I'm the least prepared to play. I just did not have time to uh, practice it. Also, in case you don't know, top of the flagpole faster than the bottom. Fire makes it really easy to get all the enemies out of the way, so that's nice too. But you are twice as big, so you have to do some crouch jumps. It's harder to dodge enemies in like water levels. How am I going to beat New Super Mario Bros. Wii? I'll start it and then play through it and finish it. <laughs> okay, this is one of the tougher Bowsers. Good bullet bill dodges, that was quite a hard pattern. Yeah, for people thinking like, oh, will you get world record or whatever, like that's just not. World records take thousands of attempts, I get one. And we're just, that's not the goal here. Okay, 
The splits, I don't care that much about each level. The splits are there so that in games I don't know as well, they tell me where to go. <laughs> like, if I'm playing Galaxy 2, I need the splits to tell me what galaxy to go play. So, they really don't matter that much in this game, but... This run's pretty good. Probably about... 1920 pace by the time I finish. <clears throat> Which, when I started running this game, the world record was 1940. <laughs> so, <laughs> not bad. Alright, there's a fire burn here that can be really dumb. Please be nice. Okay, cool. That means the rest are nice too. This Bowser's a laggy boy. Okay, that was barely any lag. Thanks for all 12,000 people watching right now, that's insane. This is the first time I've gotten a front page time slot on Twitch. I don't normally play this many Mario games, but normally I play one super well, try and get world record in it. Everyone who's not following is now keenly aware that they're not following. Imagine not following, it's free. Can you imagine being that guy? And we're almost done. Final level. Yeah, this is, like I said, 1920 pace. <laughs> On the dot. Man, do I know my stuff or what? Gotta hit this wall jump though. Frame perfect. Pixel perfect. Easy trick. Right here I'm crouch swimming, so you can crouch and swim and it doesn't look like you're crouching, but the top half of you can't get hit. So that's why I can go right through the fire bars. Okay, here goes. 1920? Question mark. Man, I know my stuff. If the split would work. <laughs> it was 1920 on the dot. That was with my intro. Okay, much harder game, only released in Japan until the All-Stars version and the Wii Virtual Console. I'm just gonna wait this guy out. Thanks to Kate, 1-1 one, one is very hard. <laughs> Let's go! Frame Perfect Tricks on point today! Flag pull glitch. <laughs> Show off small fire. It's like it's like harder to set up in this game for some reason, but I'll try. Oh, okay. This game doesn't work the same. <laughs> I tried to do the same setup you do in the other one. <laughs> My coin count is so wrong. Whether fireworks go off or not in this game is based on your coin count. This level ends in a three. Okay, we're good. Ah! Don't fireball me. I'll fireball you. I like how that deal went. <laughs> okay. This is a interesting level. We gotta go on bottom to like make the maze work. And it looks kinda strange. Bad fire bar. Ooh, the four ball kill! There's a pixel-perfect shot in there. You can do these ceiling clips. Be pretty useful in a lot of these castle stages. I'll try one right here. Didn't get it, but that one saves the least time. It saves almost nothing. I really hope I get the 7-4 one. And B-4. Wow, nice dodge. Oh, the three ball kill! Three! That means two fireballs did double damage. There's a really cool trick at the end of this level called the super jump. I'll let you see it for yourself. Let's go. We're up there. And we're getting called by a scammer. Scam likely. No thanks. Nice, snipe. Gonna do a cool trick here. 
There we go. Now we're skating, and no animation down the flagpole. And three fireworks to celebrate because my coin can't match the timer. <laughs> Whoa! Was that... <laughs> was that sub alert in sync? This level's really hard. I really need to just get through this. Ugh. <sighs> That section is awful. <laughs> I like halfway click through that block with the whirlpool. Two for two, baby, let's go. Okay. Oh, I didn't get the speed. I jumped one frame early. I had to go the bottom route there to trigger the maze. I should have just, uh... Oh wow, it didn't even trigger it. How? I definitely scrolled the screen far enough. Oh, but me taking damage ruined it. This game's kinda... Kinda odd, man. <laughs> and then I'm gonna wait for this. Hopefully the fireball... Okay, I got under it. I wasn't ready for that one, but I dodged it. That was like the worst fireball you could ever get in the game. <laughs> Holy cow. No, worst pattern. Oh, don't breathe fire. <sighs> worst pattern I've ever seen in my life, dude. Oh, he doesn't breathe back fire, that's right. That was my chance, but not really. Jump! Okay, god. That was so bad. That is... I tried to crouch under him. Normally... I'm either small or fire flower right there. And I was like, wait, I'm neither. I'm just big. I can't fireball him. I can't go under him. What do I do? <laughs> that was not a situation I'm like ever in. But that's okay. There's two power ups in 8 4. Alright. Grab this fire flower. And this is the easiest clip in like any Mario game ever. If you're big Mario, you just run off right here. You'll clip. What's up, Bruce? We'll leave him alive, because he's a pal. Okay. <clears throat> now, if you beat this game warpless, it takes you to World 9 afterwards. You only get one life to beat World 9. It loops forever until you die. So, I really need to not die in this world, because I get one chance. Listen to this beautiful Famicom Disk System audio. Mmm, those sound channels. Okay. Bizarre castle level. It's outside. There's like... This pipe right here just takes you backwards in the level for no reason. We're gonna go up top. Everyone say hi to Doug! Long lost cousin of the Bowsers. Hello, Doug Bowser. I gotta go through the exclamation point. I always go through the exclamation point. Let's go. Arigato! No thank you. And again, back to back. That time was much smoother. Uh, these levels are way easier on the Super Nintendo version, which is the, ver the only version I've ever ran them on. Uh, you get to start with fire, so it's a lot easier, but also that game's just like easier in general. Okay, we beat A1. Okay, can get power-ups in this level, finally. Hopefully I can hang on to them. But like I said, letter worlds are quite different on this version, so it's pretty tough. World A is so hard on this version. Like, just so hard. And I have to do di a different route in this level than... I'm used to because I'll fall through those blocks. <laughs> so bad. Whatever, it's fine. It wasn't that bad. <laughs> Normal. 
Big jump. Can you believe these are intended jumps to make in this game? They put intended three frame tricks in this game. Like, to beat the game, you have to do three frame tricks. Okay. Uh, we get to do another one of those cool clips. And right to the end of the level. <laughs> Exclusive to this version of the game. Doesn't work on Super Nintendo. You're not ever able to go up a, one of those upside down pipes, but you can go. Ah, dang. You can go down a cup uh, if you clip inside. And that. The game's not prepared to send you somewhere from those pipes, so the place it ends up sending you. Pretty glitchy. Look up, like, top 10 hardest Mario levels. They put this one at the top of the list every time, for some reason. Like, it's hard, but it doesn't deserve, like,. All the glory it gets for being the hardest Mario level of all time. It's it's kind of just a gimmick. Once you get it, it's like really not much to it. Like you just yeah, you gotta take the springs, and the wind sucks. But hardest Mario level ever? Like I don't know. No, don't go down there. That guy despawned. It's crazy, I've never seen that. Okay, much better. Uh, just take this a step at a time. <laughs> Get it? Oh yeah, I think you just jump at him in this version. Yep. Good thing I remembered. Because that outside section, one of the hardest parts of the whole game. Okay, I can show off one of the few things I have actually found in this game. Hard to find something in these games. <laughs> Alright, Bruce. The Tecate Kiss, but more importantly, the Cosmic Screen Wrap. The Bruce Teleport. We set a portal, we put another portal on the left. He's coming back. Give him a second, he's coming back. <laughs> Isn't this funny? <laughs> back in the portal. <laughs> Alright, Bowser. We did it! 2J done. Whew. It's me, Mario. The weirdest Lakitu skip of all time? What on earth? I came at such a weird angle, what was that? What? The grind Lakitu skip? What was that? Let's go. I was a gamer, I would have gotten that. Oh, that's a weird angle, so I'm gonna jump. Yo, 1M views. Just hit a million views on my Twitch channel. Let's go. I have 1 million views. Why do I not have 1 million viewers? Let's go. Cannonless. <clears throat> nice ledge grab.
you'll guess the slide time. If you put a 12, probably a little too ambitious. 13.0? Uh oh. Even I'm too ambitious. I'll get a 12 next time. Rip. We got a 0.1 improvement though. Celebrate your small victories. Okay, not too bad. Okay, that was much better. <laughs> That's okay. There's probably some people who have never seen a 64 speedrun and this part is like mind blowing to them. Even though I didn't do it as fast as <laughs> top players. I, I remember that slide down when I first saw speedruns looked so sick. Okay, we can only miss one coin on the slide. for lag. <laughs> nice. Melee on the schedule. Melee will make an appearance very briefly. That's how I boot up the Game Boy. Not too bad of a BBH. Stack it up. Firsty? Yo, am I a legend? The dive rollout, absolutely slower. Not a legend. Caught Mips though. That's not a triple jump. Didn't get up there. Okay. Tremidius, thanks for the five subs, dude. Christmas miracle question mark? No, I don't do the strat right to get that. <laughs> wall kick, literal wall kick for the fans. Yeah, my first speed game. You guys wanna hear history of Cosmic? AKA Cosmic D12. 2011, I watched lots of glitch videos. I would look up Mario Kart 64 lap skips. I thought those were so cool. I like to do glitches in this game. Ocarina of Time. That's just like my favorite thing to look up glitches. And then I would try them. And most of them were too hard. You know, it's too hard. I'm like, glitches are cool, but I can't speed run ever. Way too hard. Then, my good friend Brian MP16. Uh, in 2011, he made an Ocarina of Time bingo like tutorial video basically and I thought that was so cool so cool I was like I can't not play this and I always kind of had the idea of like people who do speed runs they're like trying to get a world record like super good run so they can post it on speed demos archive <laughs> this will date it a little bit and you can understand the time frame uh... <laughs> uh, so yeah that's like part of the reason I never got into it 
But I was like, bingo! Like, I'm not trying to get a world record, I'm just like, playing the game for fun. And however long it takes, whatever, I'm just playing the game for fun, a new way to play. So I went to the link to Speedruns Live, and started racing Ocarina of Time Bingo. And because there were so many, like, people there I could interact with, they would like, tell me how to do tricks that I never knew how to do before, couldn't get. And suddenly I could do all these hard tricks I couldn't, because community, let's go. And I was like, wow, I really can speedrun. Let's go, man. So I got pretty good at Ocarina of Time Bingo. I learned this game. I got into DK64. Oh, nice throw. One day there was a race on Speedruns Live of Super Mario Bros. 1. I knew the game was only like five minutes long. Even if I'm bad, it's not gonna take me all day if I enter without knowing how to speedrun the game. So I entered it, got one hour, 10 minutes to complete the game. Not a great time. But I said, some other guys in the race got like six minutes. I wanna try and get that. I got like 10 minutes, seven minutes, six minutes. One day, uh, I did a warpless race. That took me like an hour and a half or something. But I was like, wow, I really like warpless. So I kept racing warpless. Eventually got my time to around 20 minutes. I entered again. Dude, <laughs> one sec, pause the, pause the story. I gotta go to Dire Dire Docks. <laughs> so back to the story. I kept racing Warpless, got my time around 20 minutes. This is in the first Super Mario Bros. I was like, what's the world record? I'm sure it's like super good and unbeatable because that's just what everyone says about Super Mario Bros. Unbeatable world records. I looked it up and on SDA, it was 1940. I was like, wow, pretty good time. Like not just sub 20, but like 20 seconds under it. I watched the run. I was like, what? This has like mistakes in it. <laughs> I was like, I can play this level faster and he plays he like makes a bad mistake here, loses like two seconds here and there. I can beat this. Like what? That's crazy. I could get the world record in Super Mario Bros. Warpless. Like that's unheard of. The insane thing to get. And eventually I got 1934. I was like, cool. I got Super Mario Bros. World Record. I also got world record in DK64 any percent around the same time. This is like the end of 2012. It just seemed normal to me because it was all a very natural progression. A lot of times people just see speedruns, like people who are the best at something, and it's just like a big disconnect between how they got there and where they started. So it seemed normal to me, and it is normal, like whatever you put time into you can get, it, get good at. Uh, I started learning Mario 3D Land, I thought that game was super cool, I invented a lot of strats to speedrun that game, got world record. 2014 and 2015. I left. I was gone. Disappeared. I spent two years exclusively serving a religious mission, doing service and teaching people. And then 2016, I was back in business. Came back, started doing Super Mario Bros. any percent world record attempts because I had never gotten that record and I'd gotten close, but I'd never gotten it. And it took so long. Like, pe most people have probably heard of Darbian. He was hard to compete with, man. Hard to compete with. Uh, I was like right behind him. I'd beaten him by like a couple frames at one point, but like he beat it pretty shortly after because it's when Flag Glitch was found and there was tons of new time to save. I got 456.46 and that was beaten shortly after by Sum West because he's a legend. And I never planned on doing 455 attempts. I just wanted to like get one that wasn't beaten super shortly after. So I kept doing 456 attempts, tied the record to the frame at 456.46. Two, four? I was like, wow, I tied the record. Um, like, I don't really expect to get 455, but like, I'll just start doing some attempts. It was kind of early in the stream when I tied it. So I did nine more attempts and got 455. <laughs> it was like the weirdest fluke, like craziest run ever. That's how I sealed myself as the most clutch gamer alive. That is where it came from. I was like memeing the whole video. I was like, Guys, I'm gonna be so clutch and get 455 this run, but then it uh, happened and the whole commentary looks like I'm like super cocky and <laughs> came back to SMB1 any percent this year to try and get what I wanted to be my final run and I got 455.64 and that's like better than I even expected to get by a couple frames. It's just such a crazy optimized and precise speedrun, and I'm playing a lot of uh, 2J, the sequel, Lost Levels, these days. 
trying to get the first 754 and 753 in that game. So yeah, if that all sounds interesting to you, follow so you can keep up with the journey. It's still ongoing. I've accomplished a lot. Also gotten records in Billy Hatcher. Best Sega game ever. Nice. Nice. Big tip for people who complain about the camera in this game. Do Mario Cam with R and then push C down. And that camera is a lot better for a lot of situations. My teacher is an alien. The one true speed game. My childhood. Most important world record I've ever gotten. 20k! Mine's not updated fully, but dang! 20k viewers, that is insane. Thank you everyone who's here. This is pretty... <laughs> pretty crazy... Pretty crazy thing we've got going on. Thanks for being a part of it. game ever is like Smash Brothers Melee or maybe this MMORPG called Dofus. Nice bonk. Peach main in Melee, by the way. Thanks for the sub. Aid kind. Oh, don't slide. Slide on the shell. As a kid, I thought you couldn't, um, you couldn't get up this jump right here. It's literally just a side flip. What am I doing? I like was about to do 100 coins, but I don't do that. I thought you couldn't get up that platform right there as a kid with time stopped. So I thought I had to do 100 coins. Man, I gotta focus on where I'm going. I thought you couldn't do 100 coins without the clock moving. So like it was so hard when I was. I was so young. Sarah, thanks for the 200 bits. Okay, my favorite firsty in the game. Can I hit it? I gotta get it. It looks so cool, man. I really want to hit it. There we go. I love it. Okay, this is a cool thing. You probably don't see much because it loses time. Whee! I even missed the floor. So now I'm like at the bottom of the clock getting the star. <laughs> okay. Is that even making it? Okay. We're on our way up here so that we can do carpetless. Uh, one of the beginner tricks of this game. I'm just kidding. I, everything I just said was a lie. I'm not doing that at all. your hand in chat if you found the triangles to be tricky as a kid. They are pretty tricky. Even now. Okay. 70th star incoming. Okay. 
Uh oh. Okay, I made it. My thumb slipped off the control stick for a second. Oh wait, Kai, I want to do the triple jump wall kick, but you wanted the pole glitch. Alright. I guess no triple jump wall kick. Just know that I would have hit it. I always hit it. But I gotta do the pole glitch, because Kai wanted it. Number two, that's crazy. Thanks, everybody. Three for three throws, question mark? Legendary? Oh, well, that wasn't... That wasn't a big throw. It was the right direction, at least. The lag! There's so much lag, I'm not used to it. <laughs> Krista early because the game slowed down. I pressed it late because I anticipated the lag. <laughs> just kidding. That one was just me being bad. I'll own up. Alright, perfect. A little too hot, a little too cold. Just right. 71 stars. Nice job, we did it. Yo, even uh, sub one hour between 2J and 64, with the break in between. So we are still on schedule, let's go. Let's do it. Uh, the four characters in this game have very different attributes. Toad, the best for most stages because if he picks up an enemy, he runs fast. So, a lot of the times we want to get Toad so we can grab an enemy immediately and run super fast. There's a cool little double jump thing right here to get up here faster. And then, hopefully I can do this trick right. Fall through the floor, warp to Birdo a little bit faster, and I got a really tight ladder jump for the optimal Birdo egg cycle. Let's go. Oh no. Oh no. Go fast. Fast carpet. Just get us over the gap. Okay, we made it. We're good. <laughs> Ideally, that takes you all the way here, but... <laughs> you get two carpets, one of them becomes really fast for some reason. I don't know the details. <laughs> I failed carpetless. Alright. Most people probably know about this warp. so I can't do the swag. Alright. Grab the Bezo. Dodge them all. And the pose! In the door. Oh, I didn't get the pose. Alright, the whales are very difficult. 
We're just gonna nice and safe. Um, a lot of games, once you get to max height, like you can release the jump button and you won't lose any height after that. Ah, uh, get out. But in this game, you have to keep holding jump all the way until, like as soon as you release it, even if you're falling, you'll lose. Okay, okay, okay. That's the scary part. Ah. Move. Oh my gosh. They tricked me. Okay. I just didn't want to die. That is the enemy from Mario Maker, yeah. Okay, gotta pick Weege. Oh no, I was supposed to full jump there, of course, silly me. I almost had it. It's like two jumps past that. Wait, uh... Yeah, because I have limited lives, I'll just ride him, I guess. I could have nailed it again. Whatever. Better safe than sorry. Uh, I'm gonna just play this boss safe because I don't want to die. There's a strat you do where you like go inside him, but I don't, I don't want to fall off. Dang pillars, I give up. <laughs> Hardest jumps ever, man. All the frame perfect jumps in SMO and all day, those pillars are impossible. Okay, there's a huge skip in this stage. You can do one of those ladder jumps, or in this case it's a chain, and get up on top of the wall. Normally you go up and down all these different rooms to find the right way to the end, but we're walking over the top. Oh, are you kidding me? Wait. Okay, just gotta beat Wart now. I am the great Wart! Oh, nice timing. Two more. The onion, my favorite. Yeah, one more for the road. All right, game's done. Four out of 18, let's go. <clears throat> Forewarning, my console does not like SMB3. So the screen might shake up and down and who knows what. <clears throat> it does kind of weird stuff. Just warning you. It's not that bad, but in some stages, like 1-2, it might, like... <laughs> let's, uh... Let's just do it. Whoops. Man, I can tell I'm a bit rusty on this one. But it's okay. I made some adjustments. <laughs> yeah, if you play Mario Maker, none of the games in that... Well, they all pretty much play like New Super Mario Bros. Wii. Or, or you. Oh, whoops. Wait, it's this one. I'm being so dumb. I jumped past it and got confused. Um, yeah, but the original games have way different physics and are just a lot better. 
Uh, do info, Blue Goblin. Oops. Go. Fly. Very cool. Now I'm not doing the wrong warp. All right. <clears throat> Grab the orb. Oops. Forgot he takes so much longer to pop out if you don't kill him with fire. Hands? First hand, of course. These are random. 50-50 chance you get them. So in speedruns of this game, they have to just pray uh, on all the categories except 100%. They just have to pray they get no hands, which is a 1 in 8 chance. It's like really terrible RNG. <laughs> okay, I'll try and get the fire flower here. It's kind of hard just to even get down here. Ah. the speed and then missed the jump. Getting that sp the speed there is really hard. You can take it all the way to the end. Yo, the extra lives, just in case. <laughs> oh, you can really see what I mean. My console does not like the fireworks. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> and it does not like this level. Son, he's eating all my shots. And we use the star for the fort so we can go through the waffles. The disco balls. this P switch that we hit, we want to make a cycle. You're supposed to hit another P switch to activate this door, but you can make it just in time. It ran out right there. Now we can kill Boom Boom faster because we have fire finally. My best speedrun of this game ever. Like sub 11 minutes is a really good time. I've tried to get sub 11 minutes, but it's hard because there's the three hands. You have to get no hands. And uh, I had no hands, my best run ever to that fight. And I got this glitch where his health underflows and so he gets like tons of health and he wouldn't die. <laughs> it was so sad. Okay, try and get this clip. Yo, check out the clip. So sick. And then we have this one, the Nintendo power clip. Uh, jump. <laughs> Very nice. Nicely done. Well, normally you want to kill Bowser with fireballs. It's a lot faster than waiting for him to jump in the hole. But we get to show off his amazing hitbox. Only Bowser's head has a hitbox. So he can't hurt me if I'm crouching. Or if you're small Mario. Oh, whoops. I did this kind of wrong. Okay. One more jump. Oh, wow, I didn't know he could shoot at such an angle. Oh, wait. He didn't... Wait, what is he doing? I didn't know he could jump half a block like this. Please die. <laughs> okay, whatever. All good. <laughs> Alright, SMB3 done. Go! We are only line doubled. Okay, this is the orb glitch. I hope I can pull it off. I barely even remember. Like, I, muscle memory needs to carry me hard to get this trick. <laughs> Quite good, let's go. So safe, heck yeah. Well, if I get Yoshi to tongue and Mario to fireball, that'll be 
pretty exciting. What? It's fine. Maybe? Yeah, he didn't tongue. Rip. Sorry, I didn't get the orb. Okay, so the orb is a glitched item you can get in your inventory, and it instantly ends a level. So normally you use it to skip this level. You just instantly collect it and finish the stage. <clears throat> All right, so we're coming in this pipe to grab a shell. Look at this nice pipe. Half green, half orange. <laughs> uh, you swim faster when you're holding an item in this game. So we're grabbing the shell. Ooh, we kept it. We kept it all the way. Okay. We're going to fly up. The boo ring is good here. All right, very nice. And drop it. I was like way too late. Okay, uh, oh nice. Okay, we're just gonna ride this one down. We got one, I'll take it. <laughs> okay, this level is very fast in general, but with cape it's extra fast. And I don't even do the fastest strat. Yeah, I like it better in the older games where you just keep whatever item you exit the stage with. All the new games, you have to beat a level to get a power up and it's really annoying. It's nice if you get hit, you can pause exit to keep the power up, but I think this way's better. Okay, we made it. Okay, we're at Bowser. You can fly through this door like you, oh no, I messed it up. You fly into it and then you can fl jump and fly immediately afterwards. The cape kill is one of the things I cannot do when Rusty. Okay, I think it's there. All right, that went really well. Throw it off screen, please. Okay, good. All right, GG. Time stops right there. Done with SMW. Seven games done, I think. Not bad. Luigi, go. <laughs> Here goes. Dang it, man. This last guy's so hard to shoot. Uh, hardest part of the game. Okay. Focus and pay attention to where to go. There we go. Just skip talking to him. Maybe still save time. All right. Nice long jump. We can long jump here. To get to that star. Uh, 
I'm really bad at this planet. Ouch. Okay, and then we backflip. Ouch. I just played them when they came out most of the time. I got to, well, here's a Hungry Luma. I need to get enough star bits in the level to get. So I'm gonna walk in the bushes for some spin. Wait, there was one more, wasn't there? I can kick him for three, right? Yes, perfect. <laughs> oh yeah, I always forget about camera cancels. I actually didn't even know that was a thing until I watched the Galaxy 2 tutorial. Is this planet in Yoshi Star 1? It looks like exactly the same in Galaxy 2. It's really similar, I guess. Wow, I got owned. I got an additional Luigi. You're supposed to collect chips for the pull star, but obviously just long jump to the star. <laughs> okay, so you can run up slopes by just shaking repeatedly. Chuck spins. Here goes. What? That was not the right angle to fly off. Alright, come on. Alright. We're up there. Good stuff. At least we're past it. Not really that fast, but hey, we got up. <coughs> so I'm gonna like get in a different gravity field here. Okay, good. No. Get on. Okay, nice. All right, I believe my PB took forever to get this triple jump, maybe? So let's not take forever. Not forever, Pog Champ. Uh, where is the thing? There it is. <laughs> People will be... Weird and annoying. <laughs> Get me up there. Whoa! Alright. Sure. That's what I meant to do. Nice backflip. Come with me, bullet. Wow, that backflip went nowhere. Come here. Let's go. <clears throat> Probably was 
a good bit behind my PB, but I'm sure I saved a bunch there. I have no clue. I don't care that much about it. It's just I just want to go fast. <laughs> Mostly. Okay, I'll try and get this skip. Um, it's really weird, but I'll try it. Oh wait, here, let's just try it like this. Get over there. Wow, I actually made it, okay. Long jumped in the wrong spot. many games to keep straight, man. One more for the road. Triple jump up here. Now we have one to start the fight. Put out a Koopa shell first before you hit her. Oh, she didn't throw one. Does she throw one now? And does it stay? Oh, I... Wow, okay, we got zero. We got zero shells. <laughs> Should have been two. All right, we got one. No big deal. Okay, this bullet bill's really bad at turning. I'll try to lead him through the needle. Or, yeah. Cool. Thread the needle. We'll go in the pipe? <laughs> Holding left made me fall off the pipe. Weird video game, dude. One more bomb. Oh, go! Dang. That cycle. I remember how to do this. Oops. Yeah, just like that. Don't get crushed. Oh my gosh, I thought I could make it. <sighs> Won't get crushed this time. All good. <laughs> I'm gonna get this. We like getting extra Luigi's. Come down. 
could have beaten that easily. for one single jump off of him. Let's go. What's up, Bowser? Always better to spin early than late, I guess. Much better. <laughs> you know what? Guys, want to know something weird? You go higher on spins, uh, depending on what uh, thing you used to spin with. I didn't know you could spin with the nunchuck as a kid. Um, but yeah, as Mario, this will make you spin higher. As Luigi, this will make you spin higher. Very strange. And impor really important for certain skips in this game. <laughs> Bro. It's so hard sometimes. The thing's in my way. Okay. <clears throat> You're supposed to do a bunch of stuff to get to the star here. But there's a skip you can do. You can barely make it. And sometimes you like can't make it because of a really weird mechanic in the game called tilt. It just depends on the, like, how... Because, like, the worlds are so round, basically. Like, depending on how curved the ground is when you jump will affect how much height you get, kind of. Oh, thank you, Luigi. He, like, doesn't always grab it, either. It's just, like... Very, very strange thing to try and do. Okay, the fast strats for this are really cool and I don't know how to do any of them. So, man, we'll call that a win. That was like way faster than I normally get. <laughs> oh boy, don't fall out the window. Yo, Luigi-ception, there's two. You can be your own hero. <laughs> Sometimes you need to save yourself. You can do it. Too easy, that's good. Do I have 400? Sure hope so. Oof. How do I have so few? And what do I do? How? Oh, this has never happened to me. I've always had plenty. I've even made that exact mistake before and it was fine. There's around 50. Well, perfect. I wish I could select the normal star here. Oh, that sucks. Okay, our splits are all messed up. 
root boost. But I would have enough star bits by then. You know what I mean? Like, if I just did it at the end... Or something. Oh, 800? Oh, I thought someone said 400. I'm at such a weird angle. Come on. Oh, there's more up here. The next 600, normally I get them like way early on. What? Oh, the way this game's shake works is so dumb. Oh my gosh. Pudge, thanks for 13 months, man. Hope you're good. <laughs> what? I don't know what happened. <laughs> that sucks. Top players do this so fast. Oh, go this way. Like, Luigi just flies through here. What happened? I don't know. I think I tried to shake into the star and I just missed. I like panicked and hit Z, which was very dumb. Oh yeah, so here you just get on this and long jump over. <clears throat> Thanks. Okay, it's supposed to look like this. Sure. Go. Damage boots. Well, I was stuck on that switch. <laughs> what? Steps to beating Super Mario Bros. bosses. Hit them until they're mad, then hit them again. Wow. This is a bad fight. Ugh. <laughs> you see how many things almost hit me at the end? Okay, we can move over here like this. I can just like jump to this one. Nice. I've never pulled that up before. You're telling me I didn't land on him there? Let's go. 
Well, I don't know how that works. <laughs> I think there was just two, there are three stars total, but I don't think three were yellow. I tried to shake, but I was too late. Oh gosh. This is a cool long jump. And then over here is a really cool long jump too. That one? <laughs> Just kidding. This one? Oh, what the? That was not... <laughs> I started, like, flipping back over. But yeah. Overall, you get the idea. We have one health. Don't touch the lava. The floor is lava. We get to skate on lava, which is probably my favorite part of this game when I first played it. What the? That was weird. Yeah, Tampa, because, like, by the time one of the slower ones... Oh, watch this, by the way. We're zooming. Nice. No one really knows why this works. It just does. <laughs> by the time uh, you get... The Zelda games faster. Like if Twilight Princess HD got like two hours faster to give you some leeway, um, like another Zelda game will come out. <laughs> so then it's longer. Okay, we go over to right here, and then we can do this trick again. That didn't go super high. All right, to the star. Nice. <clears throat> Okay, if you ever touch any of this dark matter, you cease to exist. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna do this one nice and safe because I think my PB died right there because, like, something really weird happened and I just, like, flew off of it and died. What's up, Bowser? PBs are all on the schedule. Oh, didn't think he'd do it again. <sighs> now he's mad. Chances of dying way up. supposed to do that. <laughs> I don't know. You, you think triple jumps are cool? Bowser knows a quintuple jump. Okay. 
Okay, uh, something up here. Ow, I got so owned. Periwinkle, thanks for 23 months, dude. Almost two years. You almost have that sick blue badge. Okay, now we go down here. Uh, let's see. Insane movement. Oops. Um, yes, there it is. Now let's try this. Cool. Stop about right there. <laughs> It'll let me. Skip? I don't know it. Whatever it is. I just followed the tutorial. It's probably a bunch of skips I could have done. Okay. So we're going to fly up onto this tree here. If you bounce on this beam, you get all your energy back. And we can skip over to here. <coughs> Boing! Let's go! Hoodie. MMM shirt. If you are wearing your MMM shirt right now, raise your hand. Let's go, Japanese guy. Oh, what? Get up! Okay. That was a bit of a sweat. It's, this star is, like, really funny to me. You, you come down. Everyone's freaking out because this shark is ruining everything. And then you get over to him and he's just like, Yo, think you can swim through some rings? <laughs> okay, I gotta break. You guys know that Koopa shells have front and back lights built in. Every Koopa shell. That's terrifying. People say the eel in SM64 was like scary as a kid. I never found that scary, but those eels, I think they're scary now. <laughs> Yo, first try. Oh, never mind. Okay. Surface swim. Look how fast we're going. Once it slopes here, you can't do it anymore. So that was a bit short-lived. I can try and get it at the end again. Are you winning? Yes. <clears throat> we got a train to catch. Ouch. Bonked. Never mind, we're not catching the train. We did, in fact, miss the bus. My PBs are on the right side of the schedule. <clears throat> For each game. Oh, come on.
Okay, come over here. Get on the arm. Uh, I'm gonna wait for it to go back up a bit. Then. And here. Climb! Oh, this part sucks. It's really hard to... Okay. This is the most powerful enemy in all of Mario. You can't change my mind. He's just so strong. <clears throat> I hate that. Bro! Wait, it's not done. Did I miss one? Oh, okay. Thank goodness I didn't miss one at least. What? Oh my gosh, dude. What? Am I crazy or is wild stuff happening? <laughs> All right, everybody's favorite memory of this game, right? Right here? But maybe filled with 100 purple shiny objects instead? Boplek, thanks for the 28 months. That's so many. Oh gosh, get me up. <laughs> okay, we made it. Quick one. Me hive L. I'm always so tempted to go to that comment right there. I see comment, I click. Me. Let him have his own game for once. We're gonna do a mainline Luigi marathon. Go for it. Let Luigi have his game. <laughs> Luigi's Mansion 1's a really short game actually. Chill, Luigi. We're just going to jump over the top here. L? That's me. No, that's Waluigi L. <clears throat> Waluigi was here? Upside down L is real? Please get off. Oh yeah, you can just do this. <clears throat> okay, go like this, and then damage boost up on here. Get up there, man. You can do it. Lat Mackie, thanks for seven months. Don't die. That's the worst. Oh, I can survive? I'm mashing for my life. 
Get me out. How does it work? I don't know how it works. Maybe I need to hold A. I don't know. Whatever. We're alive. I got out somehow. I don't understand the mechanic, but... <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> need help. There's some help. got so owned. Just beat the game. We're so close. Just finish. No, don't backflip into the bullet. No. Just go. Just, just please get to that star. <laughs> what is happening? The ground? You they didn't even make the ground right there. This cutscene's so stupid. It's like, hey Mario, we see that you're there. Or Luigi. <clears throat> we see you, but no way you can get up to us. And then you move like two feet. And then they're like, what, he's approaching after that? <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> I don't get the point. Bring it. Do the bo the rock thing. Okay, that phase is dumb. Shook. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You're real mad. You're prime for death. Ouch. What the? I canceled the roll thing? Am I finding new strats on these Bowsers? Or, or like... Are these normal things that are happening? <laughs> uh. Every time I fight this guy, I think, did I just discover something? That's not what normally happens. Okay. We did it. Done. Foot pedal. All right. I gotta go to the bathroom real bad. <laughs> so I'm going to go do that.